The magic of color. Color makes a difference. Black is all colors. White is the absence of colors. And as an image consultant, one of our core elements in working with clients is, of course, color analysis. The color industry started in 1942 in California, and it's really grown and blossomed since then. And having a color analysis done allows you to know what you're going to look best in. So rather than be a slave to fashion, you can wear colors that are ideally suited to you and build a wardrobe around colors that are compatible to make you look your best. So let's start with the easy way of the four seasons, spring, summer, fall, and winter. These are the colors of spring. So in the spring, we have as the soil warms, the blue skies, new green grass, yellow daffodils, peaches and corals, purple violets, and hyacinths. The spring colors are lively and vibrant, and many times the people in wearing the spring colors have a lovely, bouncy, outgoing personality too. And within the spring palette, we have early, sunny, and vital. So the early means is that they have a low contrast between hair and skin, and the sunny, a higher contrast, and the vital, maybe dark hair and very light skin. So the colors of spring are magical, bright, and vibrant. Our next color palette is going to be summer. This palette is a pink undertone where our spring was a yellow undertone and these colors as we think of nature the colors mellow out with the very intense heat of the sun so here we have soft white and taupes and pastel yellow blue grays blue greens dusty rose pinks lilacs raspberries cranberries and burgundies and our summer colors and the people that wear them are going to be soft, classic, or vivid. And the soft is the low contrast between hair and skin, classic medium contrast, and vivid the highest contrast. These colors can be worn all year round. So if you live in a climate that has extreme temperatures and it's winter time, you can wear the brightest or darkest of the blues or the raspberries. And then if it's very warm, you can switch into your lighter shades from the same palette. The beauty of understanding the color and what works for you is when you show up only within this palette of colors, you'll be wearing things that not only look good on you, but you'll be able to mix and match easily because they all go together. Now, autumn colors are like the harvest, and here we've got a whole array of autumn colors. So we've got the, as the richness of the soil, and then we have the browns and the chestnuts, teals, turquoises, khakis, avocados, corn and bittersweet, fall leaves, and then on into the vegetable shades. So if you live somewhere where you see the autumn uh, and the seasonal change, you'll think of all the harvest tones and the vegetables and the beautiful sunsets. Our autumn people are mellow, tawny, or spicy. And again, that's about the contrast between hair and skin. So these kinds of colors are all harvest kinds of colors. And there are not very many corporate colors in here, so you still want to choose wisely by choosing perhaps a teal blue instead of a navy and maybe an ivory instead of a pure white. The last color family is the winters, and our winters are soft, dramatic, or exotic. So we have pure white, and we have gray, black, and taupe as our neutrals. And then we go into ice tones, which is like looking through an icicle and getting a little shimmery bit of color. It's really quite pretty. And it's lovely for women when wearing lingerie or in a very hot climate wearing some icy gentle tones. And then we have electric blue, midnight navy, bright lemon yellow, forest and emerald greens, fuchsias, magentas, purple and Christmas red. So we've got our soft, dramatic, and exotic. I've only seen two soft winters in my whole 30-year career, and they had white blonde hair and very pastel skin. 
We usually see a lot of dramatic winters, so that means they have very white, white skin and very black hair. And a winter generally will go gray prematurely, and they go a beautiful steel white gray. It's actually quite breathtaking. And then on into a pure white hair. And then the winters that are exotic, they have an olive-based skin. So we'll see many people from Asia or India, and even the Arabic countries, they will be an exotic winter. So spring, summer, fall, or winter. Know your seasonal color analysis. Coordinate all your clothing with that. Warm accessories for spring and autumn, meaning yellow gold. Cool, summer and winter, meaning platinum or silver for your accents and jewelry. And don't be a slave to fashion. Dress in the color families that work best for you. Gloria Starr, the image consultant of choice.